Hey guys, what is up? Roy1296 here. I'm going to be doing a quick review for Monster of the Sharper Image headphones. They look just like an AirPods case, except they're not rounded, they're flat. Same concept though, you flip them up. That's the battery life of the case. They are wirelessly chargeable, so you can charge them using a wireless charger, which I like, or you can plug in one of the Samsung, the newer Samsung phone chargers. I like them. Give you a quick rundown of how the audio sounds using the headphones as a mic, and um, I'll be all right. So, this is how they fit in the ear nothing too spectacular, they look just like normal AirPods. Um, like I said, they when they die, put them in the case. These lights tell you how much battery level you have on the case before you gotta charge it, and they give you about four hours of playback time before you gotta recharge them. But they're pretty loud. You know, what I like, the case is wirelessly chargeable, so if you have a wireless charging pad, just plop it right on it, and it should charge. If you have a Samsung phone, it works with the newer Samsung chargers, because it's the fatter one. Or, like I said, you can wirelessly charge it, or if you have the wireless, power, or the wire, wireless power share on the phone, you could probably charge them right from your phone, too. So with that being said, for 20 bucks at Walmart... They're not bad. Um, I got no complaints. I use them when I video call on Facebook all the time. And uh, I like them. Um, I, f I feel like they're a good good option if you don't want to spend uh, the money to get AirPods or Galaxy Buds. Those are a good alternative. Because like I said, noise cancellation, dual surround sound. I mean, lit literally, it it's bilingual. Uh, bilingual audio so if something happens on this side you'll hear it something on this side you'll hear it which is pretty cool as well um audio is pretty crisp and pretty clear um i've had no complaints from anybody i've talked to on the phone with this and i believe it has the one touch hang up up here but i don't want to do that because it might turn off the the headphones um so yeah if you guys enjoyed the video um be sure to let apple monster know and uh Hopefully he'll have me back in a video. Um, thanks for your time, guys. And uh, as always, it's been a... Major shout out and thanks to my friend Patrick, also known as, again, Roy1296. He does have a gaming channel, so if you guys are into gaming, make sure you guys check him out. I will leave the link down in the description. I will tell you guys, I am also in a lot of his videos, and we swear a ton. Unlike what I do here on this channel, because I am more professional on this channel, his gaming channel is just for fun and, you know, laughs and giggles and whatnot. Make sure you guys check him out. Uh, we're going to be doing a series on Grand Theft Auto, so if you guys are interested in that, make sure you guys check him out and tell him I sent you. Uh, anyway, now we're going to be talking about a more expensive earbuds that are similar to the ones that Patrick just discussed. And what I want to talk about is, of course, the AirPods Pro and the AirPods 2. Now, I have this case on my AirPods 2. I really love the AirPods 2 versus the AirPods Pro. Now, I really like these better than the AirPods Pro because of the in-ear tips. I've always had issues with in-ear tips. That's just me. Not trying to say that they're not good. Me, these um, just fit better. I'm just more accustomed to these. So you guys know what they look like. Just these, uh, you know. And you pop them in your ear. Now, I really like the fact that, um, you know, they, when you take them out of the box, as Patrick said with his, they just come up with a prompt to connect and everything. And... They're just really, really good. Um, for me, these are a couple years old, so, you know, battery life is not going to be that great. Um, as you guys know, with the AirPods, uh, you you charge them via lightning cable. Uh, I have it, which is right in here. Um... I really love this case because it protects the charging port, which is very, very important to me. I'll show you guys. You guys know this already, but this is how they fit in the ear. Um, I'm not really sure if the audio is now playing in here, but um, 
if it is this is what they sound like you know now it, it's totally up to you guys what you guys want to buy as far as the $30 uh, headphones or the more expensive 159 for the AirPods 2 and 250 for the AirPods Pro you know and like Patrick said those $30 headphones are a great alternative if you don't want to buy these more expensive headphones. You know, they do the job just as well. Uh, if you're one of those people who doesn't really care about the audio, uh, you just want them for, you know, general use, then those are the way to go. But if you want something more professional, if you guys, you know, care about audio, you know, when you're listening to music or podcasts or whatever it is, then of course, these are the way to go. But, um, yeah, I, you know, I've always been a fan of the Apple ecosystem. You guys know that. So, of course, I'm going to pick up these. I'm not going to say that I'm not going to try the AirPods Pro in the future. I really might, uh, especially if I want to have Patrick back and really put the headphones to the test. Because, uh, again, the $30 headphones that Patrick just reviewed did have the in-ear tips. Now, he has said that uh, occasionally they will cause a little bit of fatigue if you have them on at the same time for a various amount of time. But that does go along with the AirPods Pro as well. I've heard a lot of the same complaints about that. Uh, I guess it's just the, um, you know, the person's preference on earbuds. Now, I know uh, Patrick isn't the one to use earbuds as much, but when he does, you know, he does appreciate it. And as do I with these, you know, like I said. Uh, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe if you guys are new. If you guys have any questions for us on either the buds that Patrick reviewed or the ones that I'm talking about, let me know in the description down below. And, I, and we will be sure to answer any of the questions you guys have for us. And we will see you guys in the next video. By the way, guys, if you guys want to see Patrick in more of my videos, make sure you guys let me know in the comment section down below uh, what you guys want to see. Maybe uh, we can do a future comparison of his phone versus my phone um, or something like that. Let me know exactly what you guys want to see. Um, us do. Alright guys, we'll see you guys in the next video.